And now we have a hotline from Le Yu in Taipei, Taiwan, also known as Mosa. 伟大的青海无上师与无上师电视台圣人团队，您好。我最近打坐时看到的景象是，为数众多的男女老少正兴高采烈地排成两列队伍，旅馆的往同一团快速旋转的乌云走去。排队的每个人似乎都很向往那里，一点都没有被强迫。但结果是，每个人都被快速旋转的乌云搅成乌云色的细沙，没有留下一丁点的人类。那应是内在师傅用景象比喻，让我明白，吃动物族人肉的人为数众多，不分男女老少，吃得兴高采烈，四般嘉年华会，殊不知已将自己与在场亲朋好友一口一口的送进死亡坟场。另一次打坐看到的景象是金黄色的地底泥浆因地震而喷出，泥浆里面有人的尸体，载浮载沉。又一次景象是因地壳震动，倒塌的房屋里夹杂了许多人，人与房屋慢慢的一起沉入地壳里。另一景象是，旁边有喷发的火山，有一群人走到海岸边，陆续地跳海自尽。我想，这是世界末日的景象，整个地球翻天覆地，无一处生机，人类选择较不痛苦的方式自我了结。我问内在师傅为何会让我看到这些，答案是师傅要我把看到的景象写出来，让无上师电视台观众要有心理准备。若这些事件真的在物质界出现时，要淡定，不要惊慌，更不要精神受创而崩溃，因内在师傅或上帝随时都与我们同在。最后，祝纯数世界降临地球，来自台湾或福尔摩沙、台北同修，乐于敬上。Prophetic Lo Yu, thank you for sharing your inner visions with us. We do hope the viewers of Supreme Master Television truly hear these messages and change their lives accordingly to avoid the consequences that the people in your inner visions suffered. It is up to each of us to follow Master's guidance and do what is required to survive the purification of the earth. May you and the considerate Taiwanese or Formosan people always be filled with the compassion of the Buddhas, Supreme Master TV team. P.S. Master has a compelling message just for you. Inspired Le Yu, may your words of warning touch the hearts of our viewers and awaken them to adopt a spiritual vegan lifestyle, so that we can avoid as much suffering as possible on this earth and hereafter. The purification of this world need not be a bloody mess if people willingly put down that piece of animal people meat and become vegan, repent, and acknowledge the divine within and all around them. There is truly no need for all the anguish that has been predicted and which will come to pass if humans do not willingly choose to change. I cannot believe that people still willfully ignore the countless warnings from heaven, as well as all the scientific and spiritual evidence that the way we are living goes against what is best for us. Animal people meat eating is destroying life on Earth and will eventually annihilate all humans who are engaged in this barbaric practice. There will be no exceptions made. I don't know how many times I have to say it until people really listen. Wake up now before it is too late, because Heaven's also told me recently that all sinful people will be banned from Earth to elsewhere. It depends on the amount and nature of their sins. Thanks God for the permission to let Earthlings know this message, selected from other ones. I am still begging Heaven's to forgive all and trying all means to help, but the decision is not mine alone. Humans have to choose the righteous way to live on, even with all help from above and all Master's grace. May you and luminous Taiwan or Formosa be protected by the Buddha's eternal radiance. I have absolutely no doubt that the world will be largely vegan within the next few years. Out of sheer ecological necessity, the exponentially growing deterioration of the Earth's climate and ecological systems call for an exponential growth in veganism. And I have faith that my fellow humans will rise up to the challenge. Dr. Silish Krishna Rao, PhD, vegan. 
We welcome your heartlines, stories, and or cute loving animal people clips. Please send them via suprememastertv.com forward slash heartline.